semi-finals in the men's 200 meters and the favorite for the gold medal is probably the man here in lane five that's not him that's roscoe engel going in lane six engel having a very good championship a personal best in the hundred there is our favorite clarence munyai south african junior record holder with 20.10 he ran an extremely fast heat 20.23 so the clear favorite here for the title but first order of business is getting through the semi-finals bit of strapping behind the knee there of munyai but he ran such a good bend in the heats earlier today choosing not to do the hundred at these championships focusing on his specialist event we have to mention in lane four tandard lordlo as well lane two futiwani modumele decided he's had enough and is not contesting the rest of this race but look at munyai he's doing the same as he did in the heats clarence munyai just streaking away from lordlo and engel top two only secured of a place in the final munyai 19.70 if that is confirmed then i can't see how it won't be that will be a new south african junior record and more than that a new south african senior record the senior record belongs to wait for nikark 19.84 we'll have to wait for the wind reading the wind is gusting in the stadium munya is hoping and praying that the wind is legal two meters per second will not be legal and if it's a non-legal wind it will not be a record but still that will be the fastest time ever run by a south african wind legal or not well the wind is 1.5 that's a legal wind and the time has been rounded down to 19.69 seconds that is a new south african junior and senior record in fact not junior he's not a junior anymore that's a new South African senior record for Clarence Munyai. Getting a bit excited here about that. 19.69 for that man. There are the qualifiers for the final for the men's 200. But just for now, seven of them don't really matter because Clarence Munyai breaks Wade van Ikak's national record of 19.84 by running 19.69. It's not a junior record. If he ran that three months earlier, it would have been. But nevertheless, he becomes the 10th fastest man of all time over the 200 meters and only 0.01 of Frank Fredericks' African record.